So my issue is this. I have an Excel file here and I have a table here and what I want to do is I want to take this table at different time periods and or this uh, graph excuse me and I want to paste it over here into PowerPoint so when I go to do that come over here and I have a bunch of different paste options and so this is the best looking one right here um, this embeds the workbook though uh, and so we can see here we also embed we also have it linked to Excel here linked here only one that's not linked is this picture one and this is sort of jammed up and uh, when I go to expand it out you can see it's sort of uh, hazy and stretched and so I really uh, I could make the picture bigger but I don't want to have to keep trying to resize the chart to guess what the best uh, quality is I just want to go ahead and use this one right here and then have it not update and so how do you do that inside PowerPoint how do you break the link to where because if I come over here and I do and I change the uh, data inside Excel I'm going to update the chart in Excel and see that update of the chart here so how do I break that link to when I update Excel it no longer updates this I'm going to change this back real quick <clears throat> alright so first thing we're going to do is we're going to come up here to file and we're going to go into um, options we're going to customize ribbon drop down all commands we're going to go to edit edit links to files to add this I'm going to add it to the home page so I'm going to create a new tab a new tab or a new group let's see um, I'll do new new group on the home tab. New group. Okay, and then I'm going to add this edit links to file to new group. So I've got that highlighted there, got this highlighted. I'm going to click add, I'm going to click OK. That's going to add this button up here, edit links to files. And so then I'm just going to click on this graph that I've pasted in, and I'm going to click on break link. I'm going to close it and then now let's give it a shot here and see if that's um, done the trick. So I have let's see, the Excel file here. I'm going to go ahead and update it. Update. Let's change the one over here. And then it's left this one intact over here. 